Hey guys, my name is Amber and I'm one of the exercise specialists here at Alt Family Chiropractic. Today I'm going to be talking to you about keeping your kids healthy in school. All right, school is here, or for some of you, it might be right around the corner, and we have a couple of our top tips on how to keep your kids healthy while they are in school. Tip number one is a good day at school always starts the night before. We wanna teach our kids healthy sleep hygiene. This means things like turning off the cell phones, the tablets, the TV, at least an hour before they go to bed at night. The blue light messes with their brain, they don't sleep as well, and we really just need that turned off so that they get the best sleep possible. The National Sleep Foundation found that kids that are within the ages of 6 to 13 need 9 to 11 hours of sleep a night, when most people nowadays are getting about 6. So we really want to make sure that our kids are getting plenty of restful sleep. Second tip is going to be breakfast. So in the middle of your morning hustle, don't skip breakfast. All right, there's so many studies that are linked to having breakfast and kids having better memory, have better concentration. And another thing that you can do while you're having that breakfast is to take those supplements to get those dynamic fruits and greens that we sell here. And there's a couple of other things that we really recommend that you give your kids to boost their immune system and everything else. There's a video that Dr. Brian did on that. And we'll be sure that we put a link for that um, below the video here. The next thing, and I know this is so simple, but we want to make sure that our kids, especially those little ones, are washing their hands. So if you have a six, seven year old, you know, some of those really elementary school age kids, you can teach them a song to sing while they're washing their hands, or if they have any sick friends or they might be sick, just really encouraging them that they need to be washing those hands constantly throughout the day, especially before they eat food. And when they are at home with you, you can help to teach them those habits of washing their hands before they're eating or playing or whatnot. And the last tip we have, tip number four, is going to be to get moving. So get outside while you can. That fresh air is so good for everybody and especially when your kids have been sitting in that desk all day long, they need to unleash that energy on somebody and it's probably going to be you. So there's a couple of different places that you can find different activities. If you're like, I'm not that creative, I need some help. Um, places like Pinterest.com, you can um, search on there different activities or there's more of a local website called Family Fun Twin Cities that they have a bunch of activities that you can do at home. They also have activities that are in the area, in the Twin Cities area, just lots of things that are going on. When we're doing those activities, getting um, a lot of the energy out in kids, they're also learning skills, they're learning coordination, they're learning how to build that muscle, and um, getting outside will also help build that immune system. I hope these tips were helpful for you guys. If you have any questions, feel free to call the office. We'd love to hear from you.